Hey everybody, I just wanted to make this quick little video tutorial on how to make sure that your account settings have your notifications turned on for upcoming and pending distance learning. If I assign something, I'm probably going to talk about it in an update on Schoology. I want you to be able to get that information as soon as possible. The first thing I would recommend is that you download Schoology on your personal devices. Of course, you'll have it on your iPads, but you should also have it on your personal devices. So in that case, if I send an update and you're away from your iPad, you'll get the information right on your phone. I would also recommend turning on notifications for any personal messages that I may be sending to you in case we are corresponding. So here's how it works. On the left-hand side, you get to this screen, the screen that shows all the information for your courses and your grades and whatnot, and go down to account settings right down here. Click on account settings and up pops the screen and you got the account settings, notifications, and privacy settings. Now under notifications tab, you're going to have a very long list of notifications. In fact, it's so long that it came in two screenshots, as you can see. But the first one that I suggest that you turn on is on the mobile column. And this will show up once you download it on your phone, but it also shows up because you have it on your iPad. But anytime a course update has been posted, instead of off, you should turn yours to on. That way, if I put in a course update, you get it, a notification saying that I've posted an update and you can go and read it. Another one that might be useful is down here when it says courses material is overdue. Now currently I have mine turn off because I don't have any course material, but if you turn yours on, as soon as something becomes overdue, you get a notification saying, ah, oh, dang, I need to go and do that ASAP so I can get as much credit for it as possible. Then scroll down to the bottom and then you'll get to this section for personal information. And anytime you get a personal message, turn that on. So you can see I have mine turned on. So every time I get a personal message, I get that notification on my phone. And I can usually respond to it immediately right from my phone. So if you have these three things on, updates, overdue, personal messages, you'd be in good shape for corresponding quickly with myself and your other teachers during the upcoming distance learning scenario that we're going to probably be encountering for a couple weeks at least. I hope this little tutorial was informational. Thanks for listening.